What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog and welcome back to a beautiful day in the state of Illinois. Yes, yes, I know that's that's Stradman's intro, but anyway, I'm heading into work. I'm gonna head to Starbucks first, get some coffee before I head into work on this beautiful Tuesday. It is 41 or 42 degrees right now um, as the car reads. But um, yeah, should be in the upper 70s today is, is what I've seen for the weather. So we'll see how that pans out. And uh, yeah, of course, I'll keep you guys updated on what's going on. Story time. So I got an email last night from a subscriber. Um, and I actually am going to uh, read the uh, email I got here and I'm not gonna uh, say where they live or anything they just live near me um, says hey Alex my name is Mickey Doherty and I'm sorry if I pronounced that wrong um, I live near Quincy I found your channel through Dave B sell Chevy and I absolutely love the videos have my own YouTube channel myself, and you have inspired me to make car videos. So check out Mickey Doherty on YouTube, and I'll put the name right here, and then I'll link it um, in the description below. When I watch your videos, it makes me want to be a car salesman. You're such an inspiration to me and many others. Your channel has grown so fast. My parents are looking for a new car this summer, and are looking at the Honda Pilot. Fantastic choice. Um, <laughs> I may be a little biased and they love their salesman but he's no longer there so I told them to go see you my mom bought her 2018 Honda Civic from you guys I love the channel and all the videos especially the video with the spinning car and how you did that which was uh, yesterday's vlog PS if you put this in your Tuesday or Wednesday video I would really like that sincerely Mickey Doherty 12 years old so first of all Thank you so much for the support of the channel. Thank you so much for watching. And um, <clears throat> I'm very humbled to, to know that I have inspired you to uh, want to be a car salesman. Um, that just, that means the world to me. Um, I just started doing these videos about a year, you know, a little less than a year ago. Um, just, as, just as fun, Dave B sell Chevy is who inspired me to start doing the vlogging thing um, I seen some of his stuff and was like man that's a really cool idea so that's who inspired me and I'm very um, very grateful that um, I'm having an impact on um, on you and uh, yeah I just I truly appreciate it next time you're in town swing by and see me the only day I'm usually not here is Thursdays but um, otherwise I'm here all day but yeah, um, thank you so much. And don't forget to check out Mickey's channel. Again, I'll put it right here. It'll be here on the screen. And then I'll have a link down below um, in the description. So go check out his channel. Tell him I sent you. So it looks like we just got our first 2021 Accord EXL. And this one is the Pearl White. So they made some nice updates as you can see here in the grill fog lights that lower fascia is a little bit different and this one's got front parking sensors new wheel design for 21 I don't know if it's unlocked yep this one just came in off the truck but sweet car we sell a lot of these Found it. So what I've got is I've got keys for a 2020 Honda Odyssey Touring. Or actually, no, this one's an EXL. Sorry, this one is an EXL package. It's one of our last uh, 2020s, and I had a friend of mine text me and ask me some questions about them so I'm just gonna take a look at this one since this is a 2020 
uh, can make them a better deal on this one versus a 21. So yeah, let's take a look. But first, we must run it through the car wash. Because it is filthy, dirty from sitting on the lot. Especially the gravel part of the lot. So the EXL is going to come with your bucket seats here in the middle and a couple cool things with this is this center seat will co can come out but these seats here these two bucket seats can actually slide together they come forward as well. And then the third row is what's called magic seats. So a lot like um, the Chryslers, these will actually fold flat into the floor and give you a flat load space back here. Super nice. So I uh, just shot a couple pictures of this. I'm gonna shoot this over to him and uh, see what he thinks. And uh, yeah, we'll go from there. Hopefully, uh, he texts me back, wants to come and take a look at it um, today, hopefully. And uh, we'll sell him a van. They currently have a um, Chevy Equinox that's just too small. Um, they got a couple kids, so we're just running out of room. It's a pretty nice day out here weather-wise. I think it's in the upper 60s. It's supposed to be 71 today, but I don't know if we're gonna get there, but it's super nice out. Good day to be outside. So remember this car that was sitting right there? Sold. So just sold this 2021 Sonata SEL Plus and Calypso Red. Absolutely gorgeous. Check out them wheels. Awesome. Beautiful car. So, and there goes my customers in their trade-in. Because um, we are doing the our paint protection on it for them. So they're going to pick it up tomorrow afternoon. But check this out. button shifter but what I want to show you is I'm gonna go park it and then I'll show you the awesome lights to me this is the coolest part so now you can actually see them at night so it runs all the way up to about right there and then this one's got the LEDs on it too but gorgeous gorgeous car what's going on guys welcome back to the channel welcome back to day two that's right this is a first for me um i started filming yesterday tuesday and got super busy and ended up selling a car and forgot to film the rest of the day so we are going to do a two-part vlog um i sold that sonata that i just showed you guys the SEL Plus and Calypso Red. What a beautiful color. Um, so heading in this morning, cornfields, heading in this morning. Uh, I'm going to stop and get my coffee, obviously. And um, they are coming in today about 2, about 2, 2.30 to pick up the car. We're doing um, our paint protection on it for them. So, yeah. And I will keep you guys posted on what's going on for the day. So, 
I have hot off the presses 2021 Santa Fe changes. So let's jump in this 2020 and I will go over the changes on the 21. Alrighty, so I have a press release or news release, I guess, from Hyundai talking about the updates to the 2021 um, Santa Fe. So first of all, um, the cool thing is with it, they're going to offer a hybrid um, powertrain for it. So it's going to be a 1.6 liter, uh, 178 horsepower. Um, it's only available on SEL and Limited. And the MPG is uh, has yet to be released. And it won't, according to this, um, will arrive in the first quarter of 21. So, but some notable um, highlights. One of them is going to be um, obviously the hybrid. Another one's going to be the calligraphy trim level. So if you guys are familiar with um, Palisade, Palisade came out with calligraphy for 21. It's the top of the line. Um, it's got the upgraded 20 inch wheels and a whole bunch of cool stuff. Um, so they revised the front end. Um, they changed the headlights and the grill design. Uh, another cool thing that they're going to have, and it's, this is a little thing, uh, is power folding side mirrors with the little um, puddle lights on the bottom. Um, front and rear skid plate design and muffler design and then they're gonna have new wheel designs as well um, and I'm not gonna go through this line by line because that would take forever I'm just gonna hit on some hot points um, new standard 2.5 liter direct injection four-cylinder um, with auto start stop eight-speed transmission to replace the former 2.4 like the one that I'm sitting in currently um, there is a 2.5 liter turbo uh, that will be replacing the 2 liter turbo uh, and that has an 18% increase in power. Um, then the hybrid powertrain that I talked about is a 1.6 turbo. Um, it's going to have the push button shifter. So for example, doing away with this and it's going to go to the push button like the Sonata and the Palisade. Um, new Ford Collision Avoidance Assist with pedestrian detection. Uh, says here that it also detects cyclists and turning, junction turning. Um, new lane follow assist. Navigation based smart cruise. Um, so it's going to have the premium Napa leather with soft touch padding. So that's probably going to be on the calligraphy. Um, Eco suede headliner, which I my guess would be on the calligraphy as well because that's how it is in the Palisade. Um, new ambient lighting. Rear cargo room has increased by one half cubic foot. Um, and then on the inside, technology and stuff. So you're going to have the digital key feature. So what that is, it's a little credit card style key or credit card basically. Um, lets you lock and unlock the car without having the physical key in the car, which is pretty cool. Uh, it's going to have an 8 inch display uh, standard versus the 7 inch. Um, the 10.25 inch widescreen is available. Um, probably on the limited and calligraphy uh, the 12.3 inch digital instrument cluster very similar to Sonata um, remote oh this is cool remote start parking assist so basically the smart park like what the Sonata has um, which I've got a video showing that but I'm going to do a more in-depth video on it as well um, dynamic voice recognition and then this is pretty cool wireless Apple CarPlay and Android Auto so basically um, what you do is you hook your phone up via Bluetooth and then it does the Apple CarPlay wirelessly and what I will what I will do is why I have some Palisades here because it's available in the Palisade is um, 
I'll, I'll do a video on that to show you guys how that works. So the Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, the wireless is gonna be on SE, SEL, and SEL convenience trim. And I'm assuming limited in calligraphy too. It's gonna to be standard. Um, and then new Harman Kardon, so we're placing the bows that we have now, or Infinity, sorry. Um, yeah, just a lot of, a lot of neat stuff. Um, coming to the 2021 Santa Fe um, don't know any ETAs on when we will start seeing them um, I don't know if ordering um, an allocations opened up for them yet or not um, but yeah just thought I would let you guys know this is probably one of our best-selling um, SUVs because um, we have the pilot the Palisade and this and and these probably sell probably the best so but yeah just thought I'd share that with you guys. I'm going to show you the process on stocking into trade. And I just traded for this. It's a 2011 Sonata. I clean this thing. It's 97,000 miles. This thing is clean as a pen. So, both keys. So, I'm going to go park it out back. And then I will show you the process. So we park it back here in the back and then first thing we do is we put our plate frames and our placards on it so then what we do is we come in and we get one of these sheets fill in the top part here mm -hmm. and then this key tag and we give it to my used car manager and he takes it from there all right guys so i'm going to go ahead and uh, sign off for the night Got to uh, park some cars here on the lot. I'm gonna get this edited up and uh, uploaded for you guys. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Two-parter, which is cool. Um, yeah, let me know what you guys think of the two-parter. And uh, yeah, I'll see you guys on Friday because I'm off on Thursdays. So take care, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell notification, and I'll see you on Friday.